Liam, played by Johnny McPherson, has been at the center of Mina Jutless, Paige Sandu, downfall in recent weeks on Immer Dale after discovering she killed his daughter, Leanna Kavanaugh, Mimi Slinger. Although the ITV soap villain is now behind bars, there is still plenty of time for her to evade justice as she seems to be using her powers of manipulation to grant herself freedom. Moncrete, Rebecca Sarker, holds the key to getting her sister sent to jail for life but as her fear for Mina continues to grapple with her, she could betray her friend and colleague in the worst way possible. The drama continues in next week's episodes of the weeknight serial drama as Mina's court case continues to play out. Although she has pleaded guilty to several charges, including kidnapping Moncrete, she hasn't accepted any guilt over the death of the people she murdered. This is because she is playing a cruel game with the villagers as part of her final act of revenge for them exposing her to be a villain. As the pressure mounts and the walls close in on her, Montbreed struggles to hold it together when it is her turn to take to the stand. Away from prying eyes, she tells Liam she is not going to be testifying against her sister as she doesn't think she is strong enough to do so. Unfortunately, this is not what Liam wants to hear as he knows Montbreed is one of the only people to escape Mina's clutches alive. She also grew up with Mina and knows who the villain is inside and out, making her one of the most powerful witnesses on the stand. As the atmosphere turns sour and Liam is left broken by the betrayal, he fears he will never get justice for what happened to Liana. Needing some sort of revenge, the doctor could decide he is going to make Manpreet's life a living hell and sack her from her role at the GP practice. This job is the villager's life and she would be devastated if she couldn't practice anymore and help those in need. However, she would know Liam is hurting and would hope at some point he would reverse his decision as he knows what a good doctor she is. As the weeks pass by and Liam becomes colder towards his friend, she could begin to accept she has lost her job for good. Reflecting on his decision, Mina's sister could begin to think it was the right call as she shouldn't work at the practice if she couldn't have realized her sibling was a killer sooner. She knows the practice is also receiving a lot of backlash from the public over the discovery Mina is a killer who also worked there. Although she escaped Mina's clutches with her life, the doctor could feel she is also being punished for crimes she didn't commit. This could give Monpreet the incentive to start a new chapter of her life away from the village as she knows she wouldn't be able to work at the practice ever again. As for Mina, she could get away with murder if her sister fails to ever testify against her and the crimes she committed. The killer might be able to walk free from prison, or at least just be punished for the other crimes she pleaded guilty to. This would still give her a shorter sentence and so she would be able to return to the village sometime in the future. Realizing her sister has gone, however, will Mina stick around or will she decide she is going to hunt down Montpreet? How well do you know your British soaps? How many times has Ian Beale been married in EastEnders? What is the name of Bianca Jackson and Ricky Butcher's son on EastEnders? On EastEnders in 2002? who accidentally ran Jamie Mitchell over in his car which caused his death. How many times has Corey's Steve McDonald been married? What happened to Emily Bishop in Coronation Street? Who murdered Maxine Peacock in Coronation Street in 2003? Question mark which incident in 1993 killed off four characters in Immerdale? When did the show stop being known as Immerdale Farm? On what day did Holly Oaks air its first episode? What was the name of the much-loved Coronation Street pet dog who was put down in April 2020 after 14 years? Question mark 1996 saw the arrival of one of Hollyoaks' all-time bad boys and rival a Kurt Benson, but who was he? 
who is the longest serving character on Coronation Street, who shot Phil in East Tenders. How many fires have there been at Corey's Rover's return? Get out of my pub, you're no soaps fan you're either too young to remember the big lines or have better things to do on weekday evenings casual viewer you watch them sometimes so you kinda know what's been going on die hard fan you love watching the soaps so much your entire week is planned around when they air speaking on Tuesday's edition of this morning. Writer for the show Sharon Marshall discussed how the team did look at a way Mina would be able to walk free. The soap expert explained, we do look at serial killers and go, is there a way to keep them in? Can people get away with it? So we said, look, is there a way legally that she could go through this if she pleads a certain way? And the research team read out 25 counts of illegal activity shed done just on screen, that we knew about. Probably more off screen. So she's broken the law 25 times. Probably not, she continued, but it does seem in the most likely instance Mina will be punished for the crimes in some respect. Taking to Twitter, viewers have shared their thoughts on the latest developments, with Grianne writing, Can't believe Monpreet genuinely decides not to testify against Mina after all, really? What the FK is she even thinking seriously? Doesn't she kind of owe it to the victims? Without her, the case is so much weaker. Liam will never forgive her either sadly hashtag Emmerdale. Ollie commented, I have a feeling we will not be seeing the last of Mina this week. And honestly, I hope him right. Hashtag Emmerdale. David added, Immerdale seemed to get stuck on murder storylines, though I don't see why they are stringing out Mina's story after she was caught hashtag Emmerdale.